G'day girls and welcome to Heavenly Tai Chi and Yoga. My name is Todd and today we're continuing the theme of breathing with the fundamental series and today's session is full body breathing. So without any further ado, let's get to it. So before we go into the breath sequence proper, I just want to get through a couple of other fundamentals, because today we're in a standing position where we're gonna do the full body breath. Previously, if you watched the previous session that I did on the fundamentals, the belly breathing, we were sitting down. So now I'm taking up and just a little bit, not too strenuous at all, so don't worry, it's all gonna be okay. So we're gonna start in what we call the horse riding stance. So the horse riding stance, our feet a little bit wider than hips width distance apart. So this is my natural hips width distance. You can place your hands on your hips to see where your feet are in relation to your hips. So you want to come out a little bit wider than hips width distance. It's called the horse riding stance. Now, it's a very strong supportive stance because you've got a good balance across the centre line of the body, across the middle line of the body. Your feet are about 35 degrees here, but don't get too excited by the, the number of degrees. You want to make sure you feel nice and strong and centered in this position. So the weight of your body should be over the middle of your feet. So between your forefoot and your heel, you're looking for the weight over that. And we want to also draw the belly in. So make sure the belly's drawn in. You can activate the glutes with the muscles in your buttocks to give you more stronger supporting stance across the midsection and your shoulders are back and down with the head nice and long. So what that means is the neck is nice and long and your head is nice and parallel, looking straight ahead, okay? So this is a great starting position for our horse riding stance. And this may take some time to get used to, but after a while it'll feel like second nature and it's a very strong supportive stance. Now, you might notice that I always practice in bare feet. If this is your first time here, you won't know that. <laughs> so it's new information, but I always practice in bare feet. And why is that? Because I want the connection to the ground. I want to feel the connection of my feet onto the floor. I've got a nice yoga mat here to support my feet a little bit, a little bit of extra cushioning. But if you're out in nature, especially, you want to feel the energy of the earth, the energy of nature supporting you, not just through the feet, but around the body completely, okay? So, we're gonna move into the full body breath. So we're gonna do this sequence three times, and we're gonna do it six breaths each. So, the fundamentals, we come back to what we were talking about last week. So when we're breathing in, the belly's gonna expand, and we're breathing out, the belly's gonna contract. And the tongue is on the roof of the mouth, and we're breathing in and out through the nose. Now, if that's challenging for you, just work your way towards that, which will make you feel more comfortable. It's gonna improve your breathing across the board. If you're working on breathing in and out through the nose, that's what we're looking for. Nice and quiet, and you, this becomes a meditative breathing sequence, okay? So now we're coming to our full body breath position. So we'll take our hands, and they're either out just at our belly button. So if you've got the belly button, take three fingers below our belly button, it's what's called the dantian, which is the center of our body, okay? So we're gonna take our hands out nice and wide, I'm going to spread the fingers nice and wide here also. Keep the shoulders back. And again, I'm going to draw the elbows in towards the side body. And we're going to be breathing in and out. And as we're breathing in, belly expands and the hands expand at the same time. So you can imagine that you're holding a ball of energy between the palms. We like to call it the golden sun. But you can use whatever image suits you or, or you recognize the golden sun is great because it gives you that image of when you're expanding it's creating energy it's creating a light that's filling your whole body so now let's go through the sequence inhale belly expands exhale belly contracts notice the hands moving in and out at the same time inhale Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. 
Inhale. Exhale. And then one more. Inhale. Exhale. Now let's draw the feet together. Let's give the body a little bit of a shake here. Just relax the legs, especially if this is your first time doing this particular sequence, getting used to the, the horse riding stance and the full body breath. Let's just relax those legs, relax those hands. Now we'll just back into our horse riding position. Give your time, give yourself a chance to just settle in this position. Feel like you're nice and evenly balanced across the feet. Shoulders are back and down, the belly's drawn in. And we'll draw the hands up to the Dantian. And we start our sequence. Inhale through the nose, exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. And final one. Inhale. Exhale. Again, let's release those hands. Give the legs a nice little shake here. Give the hands a nice little shake. Just walk to the front of our mat and then change direction. Give the legs a nice little shake as we're doing that and moving through. Now we're going to come to our final set of three. Six breaths. Remember, if we've lost count along the way, don't worry about it. <laughs> it's all okay. Just really relax into this sequence, really relax into this movement. Get yourself nice and centered. Feel the centering of the body over the feet. Feel the connection to the earth with your feet, with your, your toes and your heel. Your knees are light, slightly bent. We are soft in this movement, nice and relaxed. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, a little bit wider with the hands. Exhale. Wider again, really find yourself centering. Exhale. Final time, and then coming back. And feel ourselves nice and relax here. Come into the belly breath. You might feel the energy between the palms. You might feel energy rising up from the earth through the legs into the trunk and the midsection of the shoulders into the fingers. And now let's slowly bring the feet together. Let's take the left hand over the Dantian, right hand on top. Let's take a moment. Feel the energy of the breath. Inhale, belly expands. Exhale, belly contracts. Inhale, belly expands. Exhale, belly contracts. Now give your hands, rub your hands together, generating warmth, generating heat, and then we'll take that nice warmth and heat. Now massage that, and massage that into any part of the body that feels a little bit of tension, a little bit of stress. I like to massage the whole body.
Okay, so there you go. That was the full body breath. Quick little sequence there. Great for when you're starting your practice. Great when you're preparing for your meditative practice, whether it's the start of the day or the end of the day. So if you like that video, then give it a like. If you've got any comments, then please let me know in the comments section below. If this is your first time here, I remind you to hit the notification button and click the subscribe so you get notified when I publish new videos. Until that time, have an awesome day wherever you are in the world. And I look forward to bringing you another amazing session from the Tai Chi Qigong Yoga Meditation World next time. Namaste.